Dr. Ying Zhang, welcome to Press Club Brussels. Uh, obviously, we've been talking to a great deal today about China, China's ever-increasing role in the world, particularly from a business perspective. Mm -hmm. How well do you believe it's going for China as far as its relations with the EU and the wider world are concerned? If you look at the acquisition, overseas acquisition right now, actually 46, almost 46 percentage of the Chinese acquisition located uh, in the EU. And uh, actually the, 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 the number one reason is because EU represents the highest technology and innovation standard that Chinese companies and China really want to uh, uh, touch. And also from the One Belt, One Road, the, the, the biggest project, the national project, Project right now, uh, EU is uh, most important part of this project. So, uh, from academic perspective, we would say that uh, China want to be part of the world, and China want to be uh, playing together with EU um, partners. How likely do you think that is? Obviously, with the recent election of President Trump in the U.S., um, I wonder how much President uh, Xi is looking forward to dealing with President Trump. Do you feel that will be a success? I I couldn't represent the President Xi to say that it is a good thing or a bad thing, but if we look at the history that China and the US is always together. They are always partners in terms of the trade, in terms of the economy, in terms of the culture exchange, everything. So I believe that uh, uh, no matter who is elected and who will be charged um, in the future, US uh, economy, whatever, um, they will definitely pay attention and keep good relationship with China. Do you believe that China therefore stands on the edge of a golden era in terms of its relations with the EU and the rest of the world? Are things only going to get better and better? I believe so, that uh, things are always getting better and especially post-crisis since uh, 2008 and look at the time that China trying to help the whole world uh, recover from the crisis. We can see that economically the whole world getting together closer and closer and uh, politically that uh, different countries trying to understand each other, for example, from the G20 summit. So let's keep the, 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 the good hope that uh, we will have a bright future.